Editing. It's a big part of producing commercials. SAG-AFTRA and its bargaining partners understand the impact edits have on budgets with the growth in media platforms. Our newly formulated upfront use packages found in our commercials agreement come with their own set of editing provisions. But first, what is an edit? Simply put, an edit is any change to the visual or oral elements of a commercial. The three basic types of edits are permitted, paid, and unpermitted. Let's look at each of them. Permitted edits. These are changes producers are allowed to do with no additional payments, meaning it doesn't trigger a new commercial. Permitted edits include five longer or shorter versions of the spot, rearrangement of on-camera material, and these edits can run in the same market at the same time. The same applies to off-camera or voiceover messages. Also, special offers and promotions were extended from a two-week use period to a six-week use period. Paid edits. For an additional fee or fees, paid edits allow producers slightly more editing options than permitted edits. The additional fees are paid to the principal performers for each edit or change. Changes like settings via green screen and CGI, or a different variant of the same product. Let's look at fees. The first paid edit is one session fee. The second paid edit is an additional 75% of the session fee. The third paid edit is an additional 50% of the session fee. A fourth paid edit and each edit thereafter calls for 30% of a session fee. Please note these editing fees are paid on top of the upfront use guarantees. Here's an example. Let's say a producer is using the upfront flex model and wants to create two paid edits from the original. The additional payment is $1,246. This additional fee may be credited along with the use fees towards the $8,000 guarantee. Using the same two paid edit example, if the producer is using the upfront plus or upfront digital, this would simply be an additional payment of $1,246. Unpermitted edits. If the edit is not an exception under permitted edits, falls outside the guidelines of paid edits, or changes the original content or message, then it is an unpermitted edit. An unpermitted edit means it's a new spot and triggers a separate upfront use payment as a separate commercial. Now let's talk about addressables. Addressable is a type of editing rule, but really it's its own category. Addressable edits are commercials specifically produced with multiple variations that are dynamically inserted and targeted to specific individuals or households. These are the types of changes producers can make for addressable advertising. Different settings, different product, same product line, different variant of the same product, wardrobe or prop change, same scene, different take. Principal swapping roles. Principal replaced by principal. Extra replaced by extra. Principal performers are paid a session fee for the first commercial they work on, plus one additional session fee for any alternate scenes or lines they perform. Instead of producers paying, say, 45 residual streams for each commercial edit, which is costly, there are set editing fees. The on-camera principal is paid a one-time fee of 200% of the session rate. An off-camera principal is paid a one-time fee of 200% of the session rate if they do not render services, as well as 50% of the session rate per edit if they do render services. Extras receive a one-time fee of 50% of the session rate. It is important to note that footage or soundtrack used to make the edits must be from the original production, and the edits may not change the concept or message. These are the basic definitions of permitted, paid, unpermitted, and addressable edits. For useful payment examples, check out the editing rules document on our website at sagafter.org commercials 2019.